Hey, Chris from Sound Pier here at the 2010 NAMM show. I'm here with Richard Hoover of Santa Cruz Guitar Company, and uh, Richard's going to tell us about a uh, new guitar they're displaying here at the show. Richard? Thanks, Chris. Um, this is one of my dreams come true. This is a guitar that I've wanted to make for probably most of my guitar making career, and uh, all mahogany, and the concept is goes all the way back to the last depression, 1929. And this guitar was one that I had seen, a vintage guitar that I absolutely loved, but people never really respected uh, mahogany as a real tone wood. It's usually thought of as a cheaper wood. But now we're in the, um, uh, you know, the new depression, if you will, and what we wanted is a guitar that was comfortable and felt okay to buy. It's not a cheap instrument, because but we have uh, customers that are ready to buy an instrument, but they don't want to display uh, ostentation while other people are suffering. So this nice, simple, but exquisite, elegant sounding guitar has been really perfect. And I get to actualize my dream of promoting mahogany for what it deserves. And this is, we call this the 1929 model, right? Is that correct? Yeah, that's right. And again, the allusion to the last depression. and. Uh, we, instead of making this a really uh, plain instrument without bindings, um, you can see the subtleness of this uh, violin purfling that runs on the inside. So it's made every, with every bit the sophistication of any Santa Cruz with the voicing and tuning, and uh, it surprises people. And how do, you, how do you describe the voice of this guitar? Um, this, we make three different body sizes, and uh, the idea is we go from, from a perfectly even EQ um, to slightly more and more bass in the, in the bigger models. So people can choose, um, really almost like working the sliders on a graphic equalizer, what they'd want in balance. Um, what they have in tone is this vintage, uh, I say vintage, it is vintage, it's aged mahogany, it's really old, the tree's probably cut uh, 50 or 60 years ago, and so the sound of all of these is the classic mahogany tone that still retains the warmth of rosewood, but it has a little more sparkle, clarity, separation between the notes. So it's a really sophisticated instrument, and it records wonderfully. That sounds good for us. Well, Thank you so much for telling us about this guitar, and uh, we're really happy to talk to you at the NAMM show, and good to see you as usual. Signing off from the 2010 NAMM show.